Welcome to mybtechprojects.tech. In this series, we are going to see how to establish serial communication between Arduino and NodeMCO. In this example one, we are going to send a single data between Arduino and NodeMCO. And the components required are Arduino, UNO and the NodeMCO. Coming to the connections, the pin 5 of Arduino is connected to pin D5 of NodeMCO. And pin 6 of Arduino is connected to pin D6 of NodeMCO. And coming to the working of the code, NodeMCU sends the control character S yes, and Arduino keeps waiting for the control character. Once the control character is received, it sends the data back. Here we have initialized the data as 50. And coming to the Arduino IDE, the Arduino IDE is installed already. And NodeMCU and the Arduino is plugged in and first uh, we shall program the Arduino UNO so in boards we should select the Arduino UNO and then the port in which the Arduino is connected to should be selected in my laptop it is connected to COM5 then the software serial library is used software serial library is used to create a new serial port here we have created a new serial port on pin 5 and 6 here the pin 5 is the RX pin and the pin 6 is the TX pin and in the void setup we have initialized the serial communication with 9600 bits per second and in the void loop as I said earlier we, we are waiting for the control character S yes. once the control character S yes is received it sends the data on the serial port here we have initialized the data as 50 then we can upload the code into the Arduino here we have created a new serial port D66 is the RX pin and D5 is the TX pin here and we have started the serial communication on the serial port S yes, which we have created with 9600 bits per second and the normal serial default serial communication with 9600 bits per second this default serial communication will be used to send data to the serial monitor so that we can visualize the data and the node MCU waits for the data from the serial port once the data is received it reads the data and prints it in the serial monitor Now we should upload the code into the node MCU. Now the data 50 will be displayed in the serial monitor. This data is received from the Arduino. This is the data sent from the Arduino to the node MCU. This is the output. Thank you for watching this video. Give a thumbs up if you like it. Suggest us some interesting projects in the comment section and the next video will be yours. Subscribe our channel for more videos. Do like and share it with your friends.